What's going on everybody? Brian with Hanging Anarchy and we are on day four of fishing for muskies down here in Pennsylvania, West Virginia area of the United States. It is uh, late February right now. Um, obviously everything's closed back up in Wisconsin so uh, Nate and I usually try to make a point to make a trip either down south and this time out east a little bit um, just to come fish muskies for a couple of days try something different and we're definitely getting that we're doing a lot of jigging which I'm not familiar with but uh, our man up front Cody Dalton here he's been showing us the ropes we've gotten a couple fish it's been tough fishing uh, it's been kind of that musky grind but it's been a lot of fun we've been learning a lot of stuff and today being the last day we've got it's the day after the new moon we've got perfect weather and we should have a good shot at getting a fish wish us luck hopefully we can get one and we can show it to you soon Okay, 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 okay. Get off. Oh. Right here. I looked over, I first split second because I was trying to grab stuff. Your rod was, oh yeah. <laughs> wow. That sucks. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess the only ups. <laughs> yeah. Must have just had him in that corner. It must have had him by that one hook, probably. And just a lot of pressure on it. All right, well, the bait of choice for jigging today, once again, we got a Pegasus. I've got a little little corkscrew bait holder with a swivel and a number six blade and uh, one ounce deep threat weight up front. That's what I'm using. Nate's using something similar, and I believe Cody has a Bondi bait on. So that is what we are jigging right now. All right, well, as if our luck hadn't been bad enough already, Cody lost a really nice fish, which is a nice sign that fish, they're hitting. Fish. Oh, we got a fish! Yes. Dude! <laughs> that was awesome. I was just talking on the camera. I got everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh that was so cool wow okay well what i was gonna say is we've been having really really bad luck and they've been messing with the dam up here and blowing all this stuff through but uh i'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna deal with this fish yes we'll just have to yep Let me get, get this out of the way. Oh man, 
That's a nice fish. All right, we'll get a couple pictures, get the net out of the way. Stop the camera here. All right, we got a couple picks, man. That's a healthy fish, man. That is a fat fish. Oh, yep. Yeah. Beautiful fish, bud. Excellent. Good job, man. <laughs> All right, well that's two fish that we've contacted and uh, we still have at least four or five hours of fish yet, so let's get back at it. I don't care who's catching fish in the boat, I'd love to catch one, I'm sure Nate would, but as long as somebody is getting one, that's all I care about. So let's get back at it. Fish usually suspended in these things, or yeah, or they like to sit on the bottom, right on the break. Okay. Uh, you gonna throw an eight? Oh, okay. Yeah. True. We are in the power hour. This is the last hour before Nate and I have to take off. Um, we've contacted some fish jigging. Cody got a nice one, missed a couple others. Uh, I think we're going to do a little bit of casting. Maybe that's how we'll end it. I don't know. Hopefully we'll come at you with a fish, but this was a fantastic trip to learn that jigging i think that's something we're going to be using back in wisconsin a little bit more um yeah we're going to get to casting a little bit here and hopefully we can get one in the final hour here folks that's it that's all she wrote that's a wrap that's uh four days out east fishing and uh nate and i were able to catch uh zero fish so we brought our bad luck from wisconsin we seem to have such a hard time catching fish on these early trips i don't know what the deal is but anyway at least this time we got some fish in the boat mr cody dalton up in the front here he was kind enough to drag us around for four days he has a facebook wow i need he has a YouTube channel. It is fantastic. It's called Musky Addicts. You should check it out. 
Um, and big thanks to Mr. Brady Martz. He got this kind of all set up for us. I met him at the Pennsylvania Muskie Max show. Uh, just one more good reason to go to those shows, folks. You can meet guys from all over and maybe set up a little trip like this, go somewhere you've never been before, and hopefully you can catch a muskie, unlike Nate and I. Um, yeah, that's it. We learned how to jig a little bit. Uh, we got the musky bug uh, that's been chewing at us uh, out of our system for at least a couple days here. Uh, a long wait till the opener in Wisconsin in May, but I think we'll make it. So that's it. We got to drive home to Wisconsin. We got a long drive ahead of us. We're going to go. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. We'll see you on the next one.